held an event and we decided to call it um, GL Life. Okay. And um, everyone said we was mad because you don't <laughs> want a night full of gospel rappers and have no singers. And we just had pure rappers. And um, everyone says, Roger, this is ludicrous. I remember one of the guys I was working with says, Roger, you might have to give away all the tickets because um, no one seems to be want to come. <laughs> All of a sudden, now Birmingham rap was definitely not, not a no-go zone, and we did it at uh, uh, Mount Zion Church, and um, we had about 500 young people turn up, you know, wow. uh, and was like, hold on, as soon as London heard about that, yeah, um, we sold out in London, and we had 800 people um, at, in London, and this is when rap was like, and then it was fire, the event was absolute fire. <laughs> What of a guy called Man in Music who everyone's raving about now? Yeah. And it's quite funny because everyone says, Oh, why do you need to bring up an artist like Man in Music again? And I'm like, Hold on a second. <laughs> when I first spoke to Man in Music, I actually found him on MySpace. My oh. friend says, Watch this guy on MySpace playing a guitar in the back of a car <laughs> in, in America. He says, Yo, this guy's hard. <laughs> and we use that video on MySpace yeah. as a template to negotiate with an artist playing his guitar in the back of his, wow. his, his car. Something to what you're about to hear now. So what you're about to see What I'm about to do Y'all, but it ain't about me Five years, no G alive, bro What happened, man? Um, you know, we've been, I've been coming here with some new young acting whatsoever And yes, I felt like When I was doing G alive last time I, I felt like the scene was changing yes. um, I felt that it was time for me to invest my gifts and skills Into local young acts hey, hey, no Keep them all silent now your life there. Understanding that you were there five years ago, yeah. So this is the first time you're performing. Mm -hmm. How significant is that for you then? Um, I mean, what that must be a bit crazy to be have watching it five years ago, and now you're going to be on stage supporting some of the big, massive US artists. <laughs> A need for to instill hope and there's a need for servitude in those communities you know mm -hmm. outside of necessarily the death burial and, and resurrection even though that's at, at the top of the list of what they need yeah. you know but people need hope and they need resources they need outlets and the song revolution music is a song that is really like kind of like a cry for believers and a cry for people to be active and not just look at what's wrong and be like man Hopefully someday it'll change. No, but take an active role in actually being the change that you want to see in the community. So. Man, listen, like for me, it's just about being relevant and being being someone that people can identify with. So Jesus was a person that people identified with. He was a human being first. Man, you know what I'm saying? And, and people identify with struggle. So if you've been through something in your life and you're able to communicate that to someone and say, listen, this is what God has done for me and He brought me out, people feel hope from that. After three weeks of being with them and them saying to you, you know, you're the closest thing that I have to a father after three weeks, it, the impact of that statement from one kid just like took me back. After three weeks, we're not talking about three years and five years of building a relationship. No, it was three weeks. I'm looking forward to it. Birmingham always know how to have a good time. And the GO Live um, brand is very consistent. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. To see them make it to their 10th for one is phenomenal. Not many brands are able to, do you know what I mean, That's survive. Right. And, not just, yeah. and not just with GO Live, there's also Affinity, which is also part of the GO umbrella. So, yeah, yeah. One. so right, big yeah. props to the GO team for doing that. So I might drink from the canopies of the scripture. Hoping that the words add clarity to the picture. I pick the pages casually. I see that all my dreams are vanity. If I ain't adding his majesty to the mixture. Feel about tonight? What's your expectations? I, if, do you know what it is? I feel like I can't really comprehend what to expect to be honest. Like, yeah, I can't really phantom what it is that can be. I just know it's gonna be, it's gonna be crazy. So that they see that you know gospel music is not just yeah a particular genre yeah 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 it's, 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 it's diverse you are my 
The maddest thing is um, the um, when was it? The first GL live. I think was it Lecrae or the truth? Uh, oh Lecrae or the truth. Truth. The truth. I was at Save then, you know, and I come. Mm, wow. Tunde bought me. And yeah. I come and I was watching. I was amazed because I think that time, them time, Governor B was on as well. And yeah. Those of other artists, Sammy G. Sammy G. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. All of that. So I was amazed, and I was like, wow. But obviously, that time I was on the verge as well. So yeah. he was bringing me to them things to inspire me. And wow. And, wow. and yeah. But so you see to be. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? That's the first time. So to be part of it. That now, is amazing. Is amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Like I'm, I'm excited to, to for tonight as well because we've got some new music as well. Brilliant. Um, exclusive, I'm released. Gets the exclusive. Yeah, Birmingham is like that, man. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. They, bro, they don't believe it when I actually say like. Any time I get called to come to Birmingham, like, yeah, it really is. Really, it? <laughs> cash, wow. bro. Yeah. You know, with the US acts, also the UK acts, and I think, man, it's just going to be a phenomenon, man. Yes, absolutely. Definitely. And that's the way everything is put together. Hey, listen, you put in excellence, you get excellence back. But we know we're working for the same team. I think I need an ad lib from Roger. Cause I'm going to take that to each and every city. Hold me on. Yes, yes. One of them nights that you look back and you be like, remember that night? <laughs> you know what it is. You know, I know how Birmingham get down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, I was telling my brothers, I said, yo, they gonna want you to bring it. Like, they not, Birmingham is not like, first God. Like, they like, yeah! yeah. <laughs> We shot a video out here. Yeah. Well, my, my new new single that's coming out, man. I got a new project that's coming out next month, man. It's entitled Elevation, and we're shooting the, uh, the a video for a song off the project called yeah. The God Zone. They ain't ready though, but we about to let them know. This here is the alternative to all that garbage that's on the radio. So I, don't, I don't like the roundabouts. <laughs> <laughs> if you ask on roundabouts, go, you go there. In England, it's like. <laughs> so, can, I, can, I do, can I do Roger's version of going through the roundabout? Yeah. Pull up to the roundabout, Roger goes. Like seeing GLI back in the day, yeah. like when the Cray and yeah, the Truth and them was yeah. coming, and seeing like the way the production was put together, I, I think at that time he was working with Uprise TV. Yeah, yeah. and um, the, the the way the stuff just looked mm. on film, and the way it was promoted and and advertised, I was like, that's what I want to do. I yeah. want to do what I do that way. That way. <laughs> Yo, there you have it. Yo, we had an awesome experience here. Rich Thanks. Dolphin, Chris, signing off. UK, US Invasion. It's going down, man. Yes, sir. You heard.